everyone, it's Christine and I am coming to you from San Francisco. I just finished an interview at ABC today and I was walking home thinking about what I wanted my vlog and blog to be about this week and with Halloween around the corner I really wanted to talk to you about fear. And my invitation to you is doing something that scares you. And so I thought, okay, well if I'm going to ask all of you to do something that scares you, then I better do something that scares me. So what I'm doing right now, sitting in public with people watching me doing this update, scares me. <laughs> I usually like to do these in the comfort of my own home or whatever hotel room I'm in where I can control my environment and no one's looking at me and I don't get nervous because I'm alone. So doing this out in the open, out in public, really required me facing my fear. And what I'm realizing as I do, I'm doing it is it's really not so bad. It's actually kind of fun and there, <laughs> there's some people listening to me. So my encouragement to you is to ask yourself, okay, what is it that I'm really scared of? And then ask yourself, how would things be different if I wasn't scared? And if you start thinking about how would things be different if I wasn't scared, you're going to start to visualize and project different scenarios than you do when you just think about what scares you. Because fear, you know, a great acronym for fear is false evidence appearing real. With fear, we create these things in our head about how bad it's going to be, when really, in reality, it's never even that bad. You know, like I had all these fears that I'd do this and people would be laughing at me or wondering what's going on and <laughs> none of that is happening. So this Halloween, in addition to you know getting dressed up and eating too much sugar, I really invite you to take on a fear. Ask yourself, what scares me? How would things be different if I wasn't scared of that? And then go out and do at least one thing that scares you. And notice that that line between fear and excitement is a fine line. So oftentimes something we think we're scared of, we're really nervous about, can actually be bumped up to excitement. Have a great week everybody. Thank you for witnessing me as I went through one of my fears and did something that scares me. And I'll see you next week. Bye.